Oh yeah. What your favorite DreamWorks villain says about you. Jack Horner. He's just straight up evil and you respect that. Death. You've made many attempts to whistle Death's tune. Tai Long. Your favorite memes are finally a worthy opponent and my time has come. General Mandible. You argue that Ants is more original than it's a bug's life. Lord Farquaad. You think that he's still the greatest villain in DreamWorks history. You also love that E meme. Fairy Godmother. The one from Cinderella was just too good for you. Don Lino. Sometimes you like to fake a Godfather accent to sound cool. Fossas. Despite their insane appearances, you found them to be kind of cute. Prince Charming. You genuinely feel bad for him. He endured so much just for an ogre to steal his dreams. Ken. His girl was stolen by a bee. You feel his pain. Makunga. Mom, can we get Lion King? Mom, we have Lion King at home. Galaxar. You love alien movies. Red Dead. You're obsessed with drawing dragons. Rumpelstiltskin. You're short and short-tempered, or you're a dream fan. Titan. You've used the Titan meme templates way too many times, and you probably grew up watching Back at the Barnyard. Miss Tweety. You're a proud carnivore, and you like chicken the best. Lord Shen. While you feel sympathy for him, you also love his psychotic nature. Megamind. You love a good redemption arc, and think he's the best kind of villain there is. Humpty Dumpty. You cracked up at the egg using egg puns. Chantelle Dubois. You want a duel between her and Nana from Madagascar. Your money's on Dubois. Pitch Black. As a kid, you were afraid of the dark. Look at you now. You also like saying his name over and over again because it sounds like the B word. Guy Gagne. You hate snails and you hate my channel. Drago Bloodfist. You're a fan of Norse mythology and you totally pre-ordered God of War Ragnarok. Dave. You find octopuses to be far more interesting than penguins. Smek. Despite his crimes, invading and taking over Earth, kidnapping the remaining offspring of a dying species, etc., you believe he had good intentions for his kind overall. Victor Quartermeyer. You're extremely vain about your hair. Kai the Collector. You sometimes imagine yourself swinging his blades, and you love Imagine Dragons. Chef. You hate trolls. Francis E. Francis. You have issues with children. Tippy Tickle Trousers. Growing up, you read all the Captain Underpants books from the school library. Vincent the Bear. You're the guy who leaves food in the fridge for later and goes on a manhunt when it's missing. Dwayne LaFontaine the Exterminator. You've experienced infestations in person. The Toad. You love amphibians and have likely caught more than a few in your life. Grimmel the Grizzly. You're a brain over brawn type of person. And you think he's hot. Queen Barb. You believe rock is factually the best music, and you've had piercings or dyed hair at some point in your life. Dr. Erwin Armstrong. You're a baby. Spiny Mandrilla. You want to return to Monkey. The Colonel. You're fine with the idea of using whips and spurs on horses. Professor Marmalade. You've read the books and prefer him as a guinea pig over his true form. Lighten Montgomery. You automatically associated his voice with Sully from Monsters, Inc. Mr. Wolf. You're clearly a furry and read a lot of Mr. Wolf x Diane fanfics. Mr. Snake. You believe he's the true mastermind of the bad guys. Mr. Shark. You enjoy cosplaying. Miss Tarantula. You think she's adorable, but you never touch a spider in real life. Mr. Piranha. You laughed really loud every time he farted. It just never got old for you. Okay, everybody, I hope you enjoyed the video. Comment down below what your favorite DreamWorks villain is. Of course, everything I said was a joke, so don't take it seriously. As always, my name's Envy Perry, and I'll see you in the next video.